Five minutes gone. Episode 49. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, the Hit Kid Worldwide here at the desk for SCA Alliance episode 49. And we are kicking the night off well. From that footage which was shot earlier today in an undisclosed, ro undisclosed location, we saw the terror of Sin jump at me, Masuno, and Sapphire. That was kind of disturbing. But we kick off tonight with singles action. Kyoko of the River City Girls set to meet Imika of the Nameless. Fight! Fellas, run, we are underway. Opening contest here on... Here on Alliance 49. One. Yoko's already got a light dude, that's concerning. Four, oh, I did the rails! Five, six, seven, so I'm an Imica eight. on the concrete. That's a baseball bat off the head! These River City girls, pure street fighters. Imica, nice back elbow to the back of the head of Kyoko. Kyoko, suplex slam. Soccer ball kick, Imika missing the tackle. And, oh, nice takedown slam right there. Another soccer ball kick. Imika, oh, nice. Boss man type slam. Imika now just going to rain in the rights. Kyoko with a striking knees right to the rib. STF. Trying to get a submission here, Emika able to escape. And oh, again with that, modified Boston Sunset, hit, no targets in the arm. Kyoko able to break it up. Oh, just slams her again, hard angle, take no slam and does a kick to the back. Scorpion, death block. Not able to get the submission. 
big elbow there from Emika. And Kano with the camel clutch, just trying to get the submission, not able to. Look at this exchange. Oh, nice super kick. And an arm choke. Trying to get the tap out, not able to. Nice back elbow though from Mimica. And the busted crab. Oh my god, what a combination from Kyoko with those kicks. European clutch hold pin to a no. Two minutes. So two cone at the five minute marker, excuse me. Nice back elbow though from Mimica. Once again, they'll play with that takedown from Kyoko. Big high knee! Off the top of Ibika's head. And now a big knee and an axe kick. Standing axe kick knocks Ibika down. Kyoko once again with the European clutch. With that European Prado does two it is. No, two. High angle back suplex though from Imika. Oh, big kick from Kyoko. The ropes. Oh, shorty! Oh, and a step up for first heel kick. That's a standing super kick. Crossbody block. One, two. She will not win it off the crossbody almost. Inka with a suplex. Angle vertical suplex. They're going to position her the rating right. Oh, nice quick judo throw takedown. Shorty palm strike lands again this time for Kyoko. And that'll do it. Kyoko makes quick work of Inka to open Alliance 49. On to our next fight, ladies and gentlemen, Lucha Libre Tag Rules. There is the team of Cecilia Flores and the current SCA television champion, Spring Tiger. Set for some tag team action here tonight. Here come the opponents. Lucha Libre Tag Team Rules. It should admit it's a very fast paced and physical encounter. The team of the All American Beauty team are Armstrong and the immortal butterfly like Mary Pulsa. Mary Pulsa, who has a future TV title shot, you would say, against Spring Tiger due to beating her, uh, I believe it was a week ago on Rebellion. And it's Mary Pulsa and Spring Tiger to start Lucha Libre Tag Rules. This old man poster trying to hook her up. Oh, nice kick there from Spring Tiger. Spring Tiger with the Indian Death Hook going to work already. Oh, what about Poster? My Poster will escape. Tiger with another kick. Tina Armstrong now in. Oh, Dragon Screw Leg Whip though from Spring Tiger, who now will set up Tina Armstrong. Beautiful running baseball drop kick. Shot to the back from Tina, who will hook the arm. A 
And there's a tag in called Cecilia Flores. And this one is on the way. Oh. Look at this, Mariposa and Cecilia Flores exchanging strikes. Heavy strikes from both ladies. Oh, nice throw. Drop kick is missed. Nice axe kick though, though from Love Mary Pulsar. Tiger like trying to ride VP out Cecilia. Nice. I'm dragging Cecilia over the head and arm. Four arm shot. That's a super similar Mary Pulsar. But Maggie Strell, only a one. Texas Spring Tiger and, and Tina Armstrong. Oh, big drop kick there for one of my Stunner from Tina on Spring Tiger. She's got the arm. Cross arm breaking. Nope. Nice double underhook overhead throw with the belly to belly variation. Nice drop kick to the back of the head of Spring Tiger. Dragon through leg work. Continue the word on Spring Tiger. Target's in that arm. And there's Cecilia Flores in to help. Big kick up from Spring Tiger, who now will hook up. She's got Tina Armstrong hooked with what looked like a Grand Cobra stretch. Weren't able to get a submission. And that's a giant swing. So far, both teams wrestling very well. Dropped all hold there from White Mary Pulsar taking down Spring Tiger. Oh, and the baseball side drop kick. That was on point. Mary Pulsar missing the twister kick. Oh, standing shooting star there from Cecilia. Not able to hold it off. Beautiful kick combination there from La Mariposa. Both teams here working well. Yeah. Cecilia scooping a slam. Oh, look on La Mariposa's legs. Twister into a modified sharpshooter, no. Oh, nice arm drag. Had an arm submission. Not able to get it. Oh, big drop kick right to the knee. And Lynn Mary Pulsar returned fire. Tag out to Tina Armstrong. Tina with the with the Boston with the uh, sharpshooter. The Sprint Tiger in to break that up. Nice drop kick to the back of the head. Ten minute mark of Frankensteiner! Oh, shrug elbow! Oh, twisted shape from Cecilia Flores on the Mariposa. Stupid a slam. Nice her Karana takedown there from Cecilia Flores and she's going to continue to do the damage on Lamai Pulsar even though Sprint Tiger's legal bow and arrow stretch. Head kick from Spring Tiger. Tiger twist. Oh, and a nice kick to the back. Oh, Brando's head kick. Victory roll cradle for Lamai Pulsar. No. But it's exchanging strikes. German! German suplex. Spring Tiger with the great teamwork from Spring Tiger and Cecilia Flores. 
Spring with the hip attack and then Cecilia throwing it up with the rolling capo kick. Finish. Oh, there's the Shirani. My opponents are now strong now thinking they can put away Cecilia. They may be able to. Got the leg barred. Double drop kick from Spring Tiger and Cecilia Flores. Beautiful sent on. Tiger to Spring Tiger. Oh, big kick. Oh, from Tina Armstrong. She's thrown down Cecilia Flores. We ain't even the legal woman in this match. It's Spring Tiger now. Oh, Tina went for the hip attack of her own. Got nothing but Connor Spring Tiger now. Moodlock. This be it. Nope. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Into a two-one German suplex. I'm surprised Spring Tiger's up. Oh, that's a Tiger Bomb. A oh, Tiger Driver 89. I know, Spring Tiger all wrapped up. Arm is being stretched. Cecilia Flores in for the save. Big drop kick there from Spring Tiger on Lobo Pulsar. Spring, no. Big, big calf kick to the back of the head. Hip attack lads. Cover. She's got one by Pulsar Cradle for two. What's good teamwork and save there from Tina Armstrong. No! Double knee chest buster. And Cecilia first and Tina Armstrong just planted off. Oh, nice tilt of one head scissors. Oh, there goes Tina to the floor. There goes Cecilia to the floor. Two. Big Bulldog. Lucha Tiger Rules means if you get thrown to the floor of a person who can see standing shooting star. Only a one coat for one Mary Pulsa. There's a sling blade. Tiger with a bulldog. Tina Armstrong gets caught by Cecilia Flores under the chin. Flores spinning, backbreaker. Top rope does a set on. Double knee. We're 20 minutes through. Big drop kick from Cecilia Flores. Tina up, the oh, discus lariat. Big spinny back fist. Michi Noku driver there from Tina Armstrong. But Cardiff from Cecilia runs up and all plants herself off the back of Lamary Pulsar. Nice knee. Wants to get off the back of the spine. Tiger to Spring Tiger. To keep modified to kill Sunrise. She's putting the pin on one Mary Pulsar right there. Oh, who hits the snow blow? Cross over on Spring Tiger, that'll do it. Submission win. Once again, the Mary Pulsar beats Spring Tiger. 
Here tonight though, on a Wyatt. Momentum's with the challenger. Oh boy, big fight field next here on the lights, 49. It's the number one contender she to Mighty Yukiko's Rose of the Roses Championship. Do you see the submission herself? And the former Roses of Rose champion, Juri Sonata. But this crowd is once again all over. Her opponent! It's one half of the legendary Sweet Diva. Ladies and gentlemen, Elena Miyasawa. It is fight time, here we go. Fight. Elena and Jury about to get it on. Winner of this gets Mighty Yukiko. For the Roses of Rose Championship. Number one contendership on the line. Drew with that shot to her. The Elena rolled out. Nice shot to the rib there from Elena. Big elbow from Drury. Hard chop. DDT! Another DDT for Malena Miyasawa on Jury. Go for the leg bar, she's got like the ankle. Oh, is that a heel hook? I'm not sure. Elena going to the ice. Jury, a nice kick to the ribs. Oh, Elena caught up a straight right hand. Belly to belly sends Jury overhead. Jury, nice judo throw. Sends the leader off the ropes. Underneath. Both ladies collide. Backside cover from the leader. Try to get the win here. Only a one. DDT. Goes to cross armbar. Drop kick. Nice run up the ropes. Boots up there from Elena Miyasawa. Now she's got Drew by the ankles. Drop kick once again. I just stood on the head. Elena with a tombstone on Jury. Top rope. Frog splash to the spine. Five minutes gone. Five minute marker here in this Roses of Rose number one contendership match. Jury yeah. not been able to employ the submissions game yet. Beautiful by Psycho D. This is a hard hitting strong style and counter right here, here on Alliance 49. Drew winning the strike in exchange yeah. though, takes Elena down. No try to blow the submissions game out, wrestled! Cross our path from Elena! Drew yeah. able to escape. Eric again from Elena, trying to rally. Modified, beautiful submission, I don't know what to call that. Elena breaking it up, she's got Drew, oh no. Yeah. Oh my god! It's over! Call that a sweetness spike! Dead Vine Driver spikes Jury on the top of her head and knocks her out cold! We're gonna need some help for Drew Sonata.
Well, ladies and gentlemen, we have reached your main event here on the Lions 49. It is six women tag team action, previewing well two title matches, I believe, and it into fallen roses. There you see the team of Fina, Lucina, and Lightning. We know Lucina has the grudge against Aqua. Those two will settle their issues, but well, you could hear the mixed reaction, the boost for Lucina, the cheers for the CFW. But we are previewing that, but we are also proving the, previewing the Queen of Roses Championship match. There you see the schoolgirl Senshi, Ryomu Shimini and Sonsaku Hakafu, along with the SCA Regional Champion Aqua. It is main event time. And it's the two women who will meet at SCA Fallen Roses for the Queen of Roses Championship standards out. Sonsaku versus Lightning. Because ladies and gentlemen, this is your main event of the evening here on Alliance Episode 49. It is a six-woman tag team contest. Final, Lightning and Lucina taking on Aqua, Sonsaku Hakafu and Ryo Mushimini. Oh, big knee from Sonsaku to Lightning. Big shot from Sonsaku Lightning with the arm drag. There's the tag to Lucina and this crowd is all over her. Not that I blame him. Lucina going for the leg lock. Sonsaku able to kick her off. Nice knees. Had a knife edge shot. Forearm. I don't think the reaction was well in the CFW camp finding out they'd have to team with Lucina here tonight. I mean, you know Lightning and her crew, they stay... Uh, they st Despite being as we know, know them as the criminals of the free world. They are a close-knit group. And let's be honest, they're a group draped in titles, except for Fina, who may look to make that a thing of the past soon. Maybe even go after the go after the regional championship aqua holds, who knows? Uh Lightning, Linda, and Alice could each hold the belt. I mean three titles, both the tag titles and the Queen of Roses title resign. In the uh, Criminals of the Free World Campus, Real McShimini now in with Lucina, a nice hook kick. So don't be surprised if, you know, the CFW try to complete the suit with Final. Special Final, she'll be determined. Now oh, look at this. Final and Aqua, though. This would be a one on one match I wouldn't mind seeing in the future. Oh, very nice. Well, Flooddy's exchanging. Aqua catches her with a back elbow. Drop to a hold. Right hand from Aqua on Fina. Russian leg sweep taking her down. There's a tag to Lightning. Lightning now in the ring. Aqua doesn't see her. She needs to pay attention. She's getting kicked. Big drop kick from Fighter knocking her down. And the criminals of the free world going to work. Nice snap from Aqua on Lightning. Five minutes gone in this main event contest. Lightning, nice knee strike. Oh, nice running, jumping arm breaker there from Aqua on Lightning. Tie out to Rio Mushimini. And both Ryomu and Aqua Platy Lightning. Ryomu who came so close at Girls Night Out. Light bar of Lightning going for the leg lock. Lightning gave her to escape. Lightning and Ryomu we got sturdy strong Girls Night Out here with that exchange which Ryomu gets the better of. Tag out to Fina. Fina, who has been, let's be honest, like you would say, like out of all the criminals of the three, nice snap suplex there from Lightning. You would say Fina has been Lightning's closest confidant. Nice standing swans on tag to Sonsaku. I mean, Lightning, who's got a big upcoming month ahead of her. 
Oh, nice kick. I mean, she will check. It will be Lightning versus Sakura 3, let's remember, ladies and gentlemen. At DCA Revelations 5, the standard of greatness for the DCA Goddess Championship. That will be an absolute fucking classic. Big knees from Sonsaku on, uh, on Fina. And now Sonsaku and Lucina exchanging with kicks and chops. Now the lady really getting the advantage. Lucina is up first though. Sending Sonsaku. That was smart from Lucina right into the opposing team's corner. Oh, wait a minute. What the hell is this like? They called it a beautiful combination offense. Back suplex, jumping net breaker. Very nice. Her wrestling in the six woman tag right there. Aqua knowing. Aqua with the cross face on Lucina. No, not able to get out of the tap out. Lightning now going to set Aqua. Oh, what the hell is she going to hope for? Oh, the, oh my god! Well, at the 10 minute mark, a move which will make my, one of my commentary partners, downtown Jason Brown, happy. Burning Hammer! DDT from Lucina, and Lucina has got to take a punch. Jacqua has to be compromised after taking that Burning Hammer. Like a double ankle lock here. The other school girl sent you to break it up. Fine, a sent to the floor! It is breaking down here. Lightning set over the top rope to the floor. DDT from Lucina on the Orman Chimney. Oh, Aqua into the rail. Nice arm edge kick. Finer into the rail. It is broken down here on Alliance 49. Bounces on Sakura Fighter. Double knee strike from Lucina and Lightning on the Orman Chimney. Lucina with the prey power bomb. No. <laughs> Lightning with a good screw 630. Oh no. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Ryoma Shibidi takes the Doomsday Shirani. A first fighter with that cold screw splash. Aqua doing the right thing. Underneath. Over the top. Oh, both ladies collided. Find a beautiful wheel battle bulldog. What a physical six woman tag main event we are seeing. Nice little leg sweep. And a soccer ball kick though. Tag out to Lightning. Oh, Lightning make that right out the criminal. So free will try to double team. So Saku fall them both off. Head agree there from Sasaku. I can throw on two lightning, gets one. We've seen her in the safe. Lightning nowhere. Sasaku set up delivers a PK penalty kick. Pele kick from Sasaku hurts lightning. Tayo, it could spine Bengals lightning after those shots. Big drop kick. Riomu and Fina going at it. Big drop kick from Riomu. Fina with a spinning heel kick. Fina with the crop with the lockdown German, but no. Sonsaku kicks to Lightning. Rondo's head kick to Fainu. Kromako gets two and no, oh, only a two. I mean, hell of a fight. 
Sling blade from Fina. Tie it to Lucina. This crowd is not happy to see this. Some shots on Lucina. Lucina to the top. Missing. Oh. Bit of a miscommunication there between the Fina and Lucina. That could prove costly. Tie it to Sonsaka. There's an armbar chuck kick. Well, school girl says she's doing the damage. Seen enough to try to fight both of them off. Kicks and chops being exchanged. Oh, so Zaku's had enough for his head kick. Lucina with a lariat. Big standing lariat from Lucina. That was to over ship it. Ah, there's the trigger knee. And now there are first ready punches from Sonsaku Hakafuta Lucina. Pain. We're over 20 minutes through this main event match. Here on the lights 49. STO sweep from Finer and Lucina on Aqua. Moves onto the spine. Right, let's send the other Aqua Force nice drop kick. Sling Blade City. That's a cut screw press! Only a two. Lucina just planted me over Shibity. Aqua Plants finding with the Olympic Slam. Pull up from Lightning on Aqua. So much chaos. Kangaroo kick. Oh, he defeat them from Aqua on. Oh. I know I tag it out to Lucina against Sonsaku. Big drop kick sent Sonsaku down. Lucina with the chops and the spin chop. And again. These wound down Sonsaku. Wait, Glariot take down, sending Sonsaku Akafu down. Second done. Big right hand from Sonsaku just slept Lucina possibly though. Off the ropes, Lucina into the corner. Big head kick! That was on the button. There's a diving knee drop from Ryomu Shimini. Like bar on Lucina, and there's the tap out! The schoolgirl Senshi and Aqua get the win to close out Alliance 49 here tonight. Good night everybody from Hit Kid Worldwide.